What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Michelle. If you're new, if you're old, welcome. In today's video, I'm doing something really, really fun. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know that I'm a really, really big fan of wine. I love wine. I love pairing it with different stuff. I have three different types of wines that I'm going to show you. One being dry, one being semi-sweet, and the other one being sweet. Now, two out of the three wines I have tried and I really, really like. The third one I haven't tried just because I'm not a really big sweet wine person. I kind of gravitate towards dry or like semi-sweet um, if I want like some sweetness, but for the most part, I'm more so a dry person and that's just kind of what I like. Um, and then followed by that, I'm gonna be making a charcuterie board, also known as a cheese board. I've been seeing a lot of these going on on, uh, online and stuff like that and I just like how it looks I like how you can put different stuff on the board you know just kind of make it your own so I'm really big on presentation when it comes to food so I think I would really really enjoy doing this and I was like you know what I'm gonna make a video of me doing this charcuterie board for the first time um, so without further ado again don't forget to comment like and subscribe and let's just get right into this video all right y'all so the first wine that we have that we're gonna try is the menage a trois soft red blend now y'all i'm doing a ghetto because um because i don't have one of those nice bottle openers i just haven't bought one of those yet so we're gonna ghetto rig it um you know how it has the seal on the wine i'm just gonna take a knife and i'm going to try to like cut along that foil to kind of take that foil off sometimes i'll just stick the bottle opener in there and i will open it This smells so good. I just love the way a new bottle smells. Now with red wine, you guys can chill it if you want to. Um, I personally just like to drink at room temperature. I know some people um, will put their wine in the fridge for like 15 or 20 minutes just for it to get like cool, I should say. sip of one of the red wines. This is really good. Again, it's very, very like, not light, but it's just really easy to drink, like I said previously. Bottoms up. So next up, we are trying the Barefoot Fruit Scotto Blueberry. Now, this is my first time trying it. Um, you guys are probably like, when I first poured it, the bottle was like halfway gone because y'all, my mom, she wanted to try it so bad. I'm like, girl, like, I gotta use this for my video. And she's like, oh, let me just try a little bit. So that's why half of the bottle is pretty much already almost gone. Um, so. As you guys seen too, I put a few grapes in my wine as well. You can do this just to keep your drink chilled without watering your drink down. This is good too. Again, it's too sweet for my liking, but um, anybody who is not really big on wine or had just started drinking wine, you know, get this. So you guys, this would be the semi-sweet Riesling. They have a dry version and they have a sweet version. This again is the semi-sweet. This tastes so good. It's like super floral. I really like it. Mm, this is so good. Y'all about to be drunk as hell. Mm -hmm. 
So y'all, first thing is first, I'm going to wash my vegetables and my fruit. These are gonna be some of the things that go in the charcuterie board. So I'm gonna wash these guys. I'm gonna take some white cheddar cheese. I'm gonna cut some of that up. Y'all, I shouldn't have drunk all those drinks. I'm like, 